Hi, I'm going to create another command here that I like to use a lot, which is the Trim Extend System line. So I'm going to go back into this folder and I'm going to right click on the one that's already in here. I'll go to the plus sign and it'll allow me to choose one of these three. So I'll pick Command. I'm going to name it Trim Extend System. And the picture I'm going to use is not one of those. It's going to be one of these. I'm going to go into this folder. And I have it here, Trim Extend System open. And then in order to get the command, I have it saved in here. And we're going to copy that. I'm going to minimize that. And the command, I'm going to paste in there. OK, puts the image in here. If I want, before I go out, I can create another separator down below. Click up top. Here's your command. So now we want to see how this works. Uh, I could just go to the front view here. So click on the front view. And then I'm going to click on the system line. You can see down here, uh, select objects. So this is the boundary object, as you can see. So click that as the boundary. And then you can click on this one and it'll extend that one or you can click two or more and it'll extend both of those in turn you can move this down uh, sorry i'm in 2d view there so let's move this down if i rotate it a little bit if i move this down four feet and then i do the trim extend again it'll trim all those down and in turn then i can extend that beam if i want to over Hope that's helpful. Maybe you get used out of that. Uh, it certainly speeds up things for me. Alright, thank you.